Hello and welcome to Bars and Bells. My name is Ian. Join me in this follow along video as I explore my favorite nooks and crannies of the hips. The hands on hips position is useful to feel and build strength for the hips. With the thumbs facing forward and elbows facing back, place those hands on what I like to call the hip holsters. The thumbs are able to touch musculature that you can feel a crease set in if we set up our hinge like in our swing. And we can extend the hips. If we repeat that again, we'll go forward with everything in sets of two. Extend. The thumbs can also feel powerful muscles in the hip flexors responsible for lifting the knee and back to the floor. Alternate to the other side hip flexion, feel with those thumbs on the front of that holster. Repeat one more on the other side and down. You may have already felt something on the side muscles here with the fingertips. They cramp up and they help keep those femur bones in nice and tight to the body. If we take our hands just a little bit further around to the back, we can hold on to the butt cheeks, and I want us to feel those big glute maxes. If we squeeze one bum cheek and relax, can we do the same thing on the other side? Feel your bum cheeks, but can you see what side I'm doing as I relax, I repeat, and relax. Butt cheeks work in opposition, like when we flex the hip, one leg went whew, and the other came up. But in lifts like our swings and squats, our butt cheeks need to work as a team. With two hands on the back, give them a good squeeze, crack that walnut, and relax. Repeat one more. Butt cheek squeeze, and relax. With the elbows facing back, return the thumbs to the front of the hips. Those side butt cheek muscles are also responsible for this in and out action at the leg. Perhaps with our balance aid, for one more, can we lift our leg away and pull it back to center. A little weight shift is inevitable. Maintain tall posture as we lift away and pull in, away and pull in, and then last two repetitions here. Feel those hip holsters. Don't forget to shake them out too and maintain strength and build body awareness in your exercise practice. Thank you for joining. My name is Ian. What are your favorite nooks and crannies? Drop a line in the comment section below and keep exploring your favorite nooks and crannies.